Daddy needs you. Oh shit! Ha! Twenty orange to granddad. <laughs> Looky there, he's awake. You daft! Don't go in there! Shut it, he's in chains, can't do a thing. Am I right, Master Geralt? Roll again! Why? The dice didn't roll! Calling me a cheat? Take it back! Look, he's awake again! Monsters slayer my ass. A regular horson. I heard witches would start out as roadside all taken in by mages. Mages who experiment on them. <laughs> Folks say they plough witches come the equinox. That's how they get those spooky eyes. Enough! Take him down and put him in the interrogation room. I thought you died. I'm not so easy to kill. I don't believe we've been introduced. Vernon Roach. Walk around behind me if you want to shake. Oh, how foolish of me. Vess! Unshackle him. Us. No, thanks. Bring something to drink. We can't sit here cotton mouthed. You will tell me everything you remember the entire assault, and all that happened in the solar. And if I refuse? I shall have to beat you. I've commanded the special forces for a while, got good at beating others. You're a witcher. You'd endure much. You better believe it. Worst case scenario, you'll suffer through it, go back to your cell, and tomorrow, they'll publicly gut you, skin you, and hang you. Just like that? For nothing? No. For Temeria. Downright praiseworthy. Where should I start? It was a long day. I wish to hear the important bits. Just so we're clear on this, I was not eager to go into battle. But Foltest is not someone you refuse. Witcher, uh. are you up? <sighs> His Majesty, King of Tiberia, Pontar, Mahakam, and Sodden, Senior Protector of Bruges, summons Master Geralt to appear before him. Tell him I'll be there shortly. Sorry to intrude like this, milady, but the King. We heard you. A pleasant day to you, milady. Witcher.
stupid war. Could have been such a beautiful morning. A war can never be stupid when waged by your king. They've cleared the forests, they're pillaging nearby villages, and they'll soon be murdering each other en masse. Why? Because Foltest's having a spat with the mother of his bastard twins. This is a really stupid war, Triss. Bastards or not, the children are still royal blood. The Lavalettes are an old Temerian dynasty, and the mix is sufficient basis to vie for the crown. History has known stranger contenders. Which doesn't change the fact that... I know. Altest and the other northern monarchs are neither the smartest nor the most refined. But they're kings, one of whom we serve. And I'll see Foltest is summoned, protect him if need be. But once the castle falls, we leave. Did you dream of the wild hunt again? Mm -hmm. I get the feeling that dream's important. Running frantically through the forest. The wild hunt. They're the last things I remember. I wake up and try to relive the dream and the memory, hoping I'll find some guidance. Some clue to grab onto. Something that'll help me recover my memory. Dreams can be very powerful. Some people claim they can even shape reality. People claim a lot of things. The problem is, it's often nonsense. We'll know in time. I'm sure of it. Alright. Time to look to the lustful king and his stupid war. I'll join you later. day for battle. Fear not, Excellency, we're out of range of their arbalists. I am no warrior, sire. I must admit, I prefer to joust verbally, or with a pen, the emissary of peace that I am. Hogwash! You're the emissary of the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes, the Emperor of Nilfgaard, who spared no blood conquering over a dozen sovereign realms. Thus bringing them laws, culture, and peace. Finally! Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. Sire. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, your grace, of soldiers who... Those who did this, did no more. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency, but I plan to leave the royal court as soon as possible. Might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenneran during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sadel. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. 
Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. Forgive my candor, Your Majesty, but uh, I must ask, what fate awaits the royal bastards when they're my children? If I hear bastard one more time, someone will die. Painfully. Your Grace, forgive me. But the laws of succession are irrefutably clear. Piss on the laws. I'll change them if need be. Above all, I'll not allow a band of treacherous barons to use my children as their banner. Your Majesty is entirely within his rights. Adder is dead. And I have no other children. I see. This conversation is over, Excellency. Please retire to your tent. Black ones in my camp before a battle. What has the world come to? Nothing would make me happier than returning his shriveled head to Emir in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Was I? I couldn't have handled it better myself. Ha! I always knew you were one of us. And bugger what folks say. They talk about Anna no end. Have you learned anything about the assassin? Nothing new, sire. Months back, we got more than we knew when we began. This investigation's going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits. It's just a question of time. Now, for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Thank you, sire. Where are you aiming, imbecile? Soldier! Spyglass! What is going on up there? The gods! Down at your belly! Catch, Witcher! Aim for the rogue with the red plume! Not six months ago, he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! How much higher? Two and a half degrees. Did we hit the bastard? He ducked. Damn it. We'll get him on the walls. Follow me, Witcher. You know, Witcher, I'm prepared to forgive Louisa. All she need do is to kneel before her king. Very noble of you. Are you mocking me? Never mind. I'm certain Louisa will realize her mistakes. Besides, children should have a mother. I'm lost. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a tiff. She made demands I could not fulfill. Understand? I think so. Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened, all noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children. They would protect them, even place them on the throne. And the Baroness was duped, a motherly love used. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. Going a country there, your wife! And a long road at your toe! On the bridge! 
We're nearly there! Weapons at the ready! That tower was ridiculous. It was designed to break the rebels' morale. A bunch of lords and lordlings took a ride to then pompously stride on top of the walls, while the real army fought and died below them in the shit and piss-filled streets. If years of service have taught me anything, it's that the Highborn don the best costumes and get the best vantage points, whether at a ball or in battle. But it's not the time for that kind of jousting, Witcher. Continue your story. Things went relatively smoothly after we came out of that tower. That is, until we ran into Arian Lavalette. You shall push for the center aisle and bring down that gate. It's a good day to kill, your majesty. Follow me, gentlemen. For Temeria! Lord Swan, you and your men shall follow me. We must capture or otherwise deal with Arian Lavalette in order to break the defender's morale. Yes, your grace. Geralt, gentlemen, follow me. For the glory! Fall back, God damn it! I forbid you to die like imbeciles! Hear me! They've taken a good position, the bastards! If this persists, they'll pick us off like ducks, and I'm no duck! Any ideas? That ballista would do the trick.
tower! The gods are with us! Down with tyranny! Like the rabid dogs you are! Arian Lavalette, this will be no easy task. Surrender, Arian! You'll be treated with honor! Go plow yourself, King! Bury them in arrows! Come on, men! For Temeria! They're well shielded. You've got a better idea? I'll try to get inside. It shouldn't be hard if the archers provide cover. That's the son of Louisa and the old Baron. Heir to these lands. He's hot-tempered, but good with a sword. Be careful. I'll try to reason with him. Cover the Witcher!
the famed Geralt of Rivia. You've fallen low, Witcher. Word has it you're one of the best swordsmen in the north. Time to test that rumor. If you insist. Halt! He's mine! The successor of one of Temeria's oldest families perished at the hands of a monster slayer. A sign of the times, I suppose. You mourn Arian? No. He was one of a dying breed. And he was a traitor. Continue. While I remember, what happened to the dragon? It destroyed half the castle. Killed hordes of soldiers and flew off. Where? In the general direction of Edon. To think it almost killed us all. Arian Lavalet has surrendered the castle. Open the gate! Arian lives! Open now! Kneel before your king and I shall show you mercy! Looks like we're stuck. Indeed, and my magic's no good here. The main force down in those boats is going to beat us to town. Want to head back to the tent? The camp will be nice and empty now. I've had enough for today. Tempting. Look, the king's special forces. What of the Baron? You really had to kill him. sometimes. Sire. Vernon Roach. Tell me, Roach. There's fighting in the town. A section of our forces crossed the river in fishing boats and swarmed the streets, burning, raping, pillaging. The Lavalettes are making a stand near the temple. What of the Baroness? Alive and safely tucked away. Unsoiled, I hope. As you ordered, Sire. She's fine. And beautiful as ever. The children were not with her. But you know where they are? In the monastery. But we've yet to penetrate that area. Cross, quickly! Protect the king!
quickly! Go! I'll manage! Quick! Chris! The bridge is burning! Quickly, this way! The flowering dragon nearly reversed the course of the battle. The fighting should have scared it off. Forget the dragon. I need to hear how this story ends. You were at my side almost all the time after the bridge collapsed. Almost. Tell me how you got into the monastery courtyard. And they said we couldn't get near the walls. Half a day and the town is taken. Report! Fighting for the castle continues, and a group of rebels have barricaded themselves inside the monastery. What of my children? Likely in the church as well, sire. Fen took a priest to task, finally mumbled something about a passage neath the walls. It would take a week to get a battering ram in here. Axes, sire. That will also take time. But what other course do we have? This priest. What of him? What of this passage? I fainted for I could really get going on him. He's under guard below. You've some work to do, Commander. Yes, sire. Silas, you look to this door. Fen, come with me. Witcher. Your grace. I have a mission for you, one suited to your abilities. Vernon can be persuasive, but he's also hot-tempered, at times losing both his self-control and his subject. You must try to find this other passage on your own. Succeed, and you'll be the envy of all Vizima. All right, I'll go. I'm relying on you, Witcher. Better those axes! Move your asses! Would you release us, soldier, Just sir? Just following orders. Shut it. We're innocent. The king will decide your fate. Godzellabuzz! <laughs> what have you done to her? Help! Time to... These people are unarmed. This is not your concern. Get lost. Get out of here. Now. Uh. Right, sir. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Be careful. You may not be so lucky next time. Find a place to hide. I must find my wife first. They herded her away with others like cattle. Good luck. Tainted souls. You've no business here! Leave them alone. They're innocent. Innocent? They're with the lavalettes! Weeds that need to be ripped out with their roots so they won't grow back again! Treason spreads like the plague. No one will leave here alive. And you stay out of this. I won't stand by while you murder innocents. So, what'll you do? Kill you. I was not after your blood! I have witnesses! Let the people out and walk away. Unblock the door! I'll report this. Yeah, you do that. 
Burn anything or touch a single woman, you sons of bitches. The king will hear of us. Leave us be! You're free. Thank you, my lord. Find a place to hide until this madness ends. But where? They've taken all from us, save our life. What shall we do now? And now, whole son, shall answer for treason. What treason, my lord? We're simple folk and know nothing of politics. Lover let lost, so you whimper like dogs. What will you do?
You have just become the most titled witcher in the world. And the wealthiest. I'll remind you of that when this is all over, sire. See, Vernon? Geralt succeeded. Lucky he did. The priest was downright discourteous and went off to meet his gods. I saw Scoia'tael on the river. Where? How many? What colors did they wear? Plow the elves. We'll tend to them later. The monastery awaits. Goyatel. This puzzle is beginning to come together, Geralt. You're either telling the truth, or weaving a very convincing lie. I want to hear the rest. Foltes bastards. The Solar. What happened? We might have arrived at the same time, if not for tales. Be specific, Witcher. Well, the Archpriest told the truth. His Majesty King Foltest of Temeria. Arthur Tales, erstwhile Count of Nesvelt. I signed your sentence. Yes, yet the Baroness saw fit to pardon me. An awkward situation, to be sure. Anais and Busi, where are they? The royal children. Don't test my patience, Tales, and I'll grant you a quick death. Confess, Foltest, before the gods and the people. Busi and Anais are the fruit of your loins. Bow to the gods and admit the truth. You may not have noticed, Tails, but I just took this town. Aided by murderers, sorcerers, and a mutant for whom nothing is holy. This is hallowed ground. You will not raise your hand against a servant of the gods. Where have you taken the children? The Solar. They're in the Solar. What is this? Blasphemy! Sorcerer's tricks! Quiet down, Tails. This is a church. I'll not forget this, mutant. You hear? Damn! I've seen assaults go awry, but the dragon topples them all.
tops. Tops what? Well, tops all. Damn nonsense! Geralt, you should know. Is it possible to tame a dragon? The dragon's back! I... Uh...